we're supposed to be people who who look at life and look at society and our civilization and, and the various structures or whatever and you know we're we serve as sort of a mirror to what we see and that includes the 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 uglier stuff so we have mm -hmm. to find a way to be more in tune that's why so many artists are freaking crazy yes <laughs> you know exactly. because they they live in this realm of you know the unseen the unknown right. the unspeakable there was an actress i think it was might have been was it sarah bernhard maybe i forgot who it was but she said she was talking about actors specifically they have to be more human than humans mm, you know you have to be in yeah. touch with all that all that stuff i love that because that's to me what you're touching on is this division, right, between polite society, everyday life, where we go about things. We hold the door open for strangers. We're polite. We keep it together throughout the day. But where do you release all that mm. pain, all that grief, all that anger, all that fear, if not in art? Whether you're creating or consuming it, having that cathartic experience through consuming art or through creating it. And so if we're shrinking that realm, we're shrinking what's allowed in the realm of art, we're shrinking the human experience, essentially. Because now all these other things have, that are not allowed in polite society and your everyday expression, well, they're no longer allowed in the realm of art either. And it doesn't get rid of them. It just suppresses.